Hi friends, this tutorial I will teach uh, message box to asking uh, if the user want to exit like that. Okay, first of all, uh, I will run this project. This is one project, it's like a combo box and thing. So now I am, I need to close here. It's simply closed, but I need, I need to, uh, I want to close the time the message box will be asking uh, do you want to close or do you want to exit like that so I how will we uh, create like that so first of all this is our form go to this form properties here event is there click the event here you will find the uh, closing event okay just press enter here once click the cursor after that you can press the enter here so you will uh, go to the navigate to the coding part like a even like form closing event okay this is combo box is here, our form name and the closing event uh, closing form closing is here, our uh, event name okay so so here I just put message box dot show do you on exit yes simply I'm putting message box do you want to exit and now I am try to run the project. I am closing. So I get the message. Do you want to exit? And click OK. It simply exit. But I need. Do you want to exit? Yes. I press yes. Then it will be exit. Or else no. Then it won't be exit. So do you want to uh, exit? Yeah. There is a. So after that, I'm alert message box button dot has a message box icon dot. Now I run the project and close it. It will be asking alert. This is a text. Add a text and do you want to exit? And press yes. Then is exit and press no. Then also exit. And no, then you won't be exit. But now, now the situation. So just I press no. It also exit. So I need to write the query for here. Okay, I need to write the query for here. So, what will do? I will. So, I need to track them. This message press yes or no. So, I am need to track. So, here I will write dialog result. Uh, yes, you L T here in result equal to after that so I'm getting the values from result here if if result equal to dialog result dot yes you need to put two equal signs so comparing then
application dot exit else e dot cancel equal to true I'll save run again so no it won't be close and press yes it's close but here you will see I press yes now it will be asking two times because I need to execute exit here exit then another time the closing event will be triggered here so just time hide these lines and run once again yes it closed no that it won't be asking so what we'll do if before that I am putting not sorry here dot no control x and control v and delete now I am running the project I put yes it's closed I put no it won't be closed so guys we will get those like because first time it will be getting no then e dot cancel e cancel equal to true cancel equal to true means the event won't be occurred but i uh, not equal to no anything is comes now it automatically exit okay that's the things we are written here okay guys we will meet our next good tutorial bye see you later